What's your name? It, it, it's James. Okay, James. You got a first aid kit? C kind of. Get it. Fast. Whatever we're gonna do, we gotta do it fast. doing with that Sam Sam I got you I'm here uh, I need to clean the wound uh, Sam uh, is the bullet still in there didn't punch through we gotta we gotta get it out right there's too much blood uh, you're gonna have to use this Hold her down. This is gonna really fucking hurt. Hold her down! You two! We got her. Saving her life. With that? Are you insane? Let me do this. I've almost got the wound closed. James, let me. Is she going to make it? I can't lose her. I can't. My poor Samantha. I don't know. 
But we did all we could. Tell me, what happened? You appear out of nowhere, with my daughter nearly bleeding to death? I saved Sam. Carried her through a walker-infested forest back to you. When Sam wakes up, we'll see what really happened. Look at me. I don't know who the hell you are, but... Dad! Dad? Where is Greg? Sam should be the one to tell you. Tell us what? Greg didn't come back with them. What? What do you mean? No. <laughs> it's okay, boys. It's okay. I'm Colette? Elodie? You girls in here? Elodie. I didn't make things.
girls? You in here? They're not. I'm alone here. When no one was picking up, I thought... God, I, I didn't even want to say it. I, I, I talked to Dominic earlier, but there was... There was screaming. Christ, it was horrible. I don't know if it was him or who, but... God, Michonne, he sounded so scared. The girls, too. Crying, just crying. I, I couldn't stand it. Poor thing, they must be terrified. Donna, where was he taking the girls? Here. To my place. Outside the city. Thought it'd be safer. But they should have been here hours ago. We have to find them. They could be anywhere. And if we can't get a hold of them, I I don't I'm gonna keep searching here. Hey, hey, no. Donna! Donna, get out of there now! Donna! Well, who's Donna? Did you say Donna? You okay? Just thinking about someone I once knew. It's okay. I do that too. John, he... he went to talk to the kids, make sure they're all right, while I watched over you. Sorry about this. John isn't big on people he doesn't know. Are the kids holding up? I don't know. Can't be good. Their brother's dead, sister's shot. I mean, fuck, right?
So, yeah, this is where I apologize for almost shooting you. Emphasis on almost. I was just worried. Don't worry about it. Happens more often than I like to admit. If it makes you feel any better, I'm not a great shot. That patch of dirt, his mom's buried there. A year or so back, she just... She was sick. Not in the head. Something with her heart. She couldn't handle it, I guess. I never understood that. We were safe here. You can't give in. You have to keep going, no matter what. Sam said the same thing to her mom just a few days before. When she did it, I'd never seen Sam so angry. If it wasn't for Sam... Sam. Hey, don't move, okay? Don't move. Sam, no. Mission, we have to help him. You're too weak. Pull me up. Just stay down, Sam. I need to help him. Go back to sleep, Sam. But... You need rest. Sam. I know John can make a strong first impression, but he's what's keeping this entire family from being buried out there. You gotta fight like hell for what you care about, right? Something that makes all this shit worth it. Yeah. Fight until the day you die. You'd be crazy to stay here, John. This woman normally Enough. will... There's no decision to be made on this. I need a word with you. In private. Do you have children? A son? I do. Two little girls. <sighs> it snowed the day my wife died. Her heart gave out. Sam found her. She... She passed in her sleep. We buried her so the boys wouldn't have to see her like that. The snow... It covered her grave. Erased it. Like she'd never been there at all. 
I'm really sorry for your loss. Thank you. I've tried to focus on our kids, but the past, it always seems to find you. Ever since Sophia, I've tried to keep our family from harm, but we're falling apart, piece by piece. And now that Sam's hurt, and Greg's, I could really use your help. Your friend Pete told me all about Norma, about what happened. If she finds us, we wouldn't stand a chance. But you seem like someone who can hold their own. You've got a good thing going here. Safe house, nice family. It's more rare than you know. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Children shouldn't have to see this. Greg never turned into one of these things, did he? Are those... whatever they are. No, he was Greg until the end. <gasps> Thank God. I'm sorry. I'm trying to keep it together. But what if you just found out your daughters were dead? And you weren't there. You were miles away, safe and sound. Your kids need you to stay strong. You, you're right. I'm all they have. Peekaboo.
Dead yet. Uh, uh, you? Yourself, huh? Caught yourself a golden goose. You think I'm shitting any eggs? Forget it. I'm asking the questions here. Say now, won't this be fun? That's up to you. <clears throat> My crew. Where are they? At the bottom of the bay. Getting nibbled on by crabs. Damn. I guess you do have a heart. Randall? Randall, are you getting this? You, uh, wanna get that for me? We heard gunshots. If you don't check in, I'm sending everyone in that direction. Shit. She sounds pissed. Randall, pick up, goddammit. You gonna answer? Talk to her, Michelle. Don't make the same mistake again. Where the hell are you? You heard her. Randall needs to check in. You know, this feels mighty familiar. Except you're there. And I'm here. So, Miss Shum, what do you want me to say to her? On account of me hoping to avoid more broken fingers, your wish is my command. Say something stupid, and you'll regret it. You sound just like my daddy. He's a mean son of a bitch. His belt was even meaner. So I learned not to cross his path twice. I'll play along. Hey, Norma. Randall, are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. I'm so hey! I wasn't finished yet. I was doing what you said, Miss Shirley. How can you not trust a face like this? You said all you needed to. Nice try. Randall? I lost you. What, what were you saying? Hello, Norma. Michelle. Hurt him. You so much as breathed on my brother, I'll find you and make what happened on the ferry look like a goddamn picnic! He's fine. Haven't touched him. Good girl. Be reasonable, Michonne. That's all I ask. We'll be there soon. You know, this alone time, you and me together, it's been real nice. But that all ends when my sister gets here. I'm gonna take that wrench and break your skull. Then Sam's and yours. And last but not least, those kitties too. I saw their little heads in the window. Kids, you know, their skulls don't break so much as kind of melt. I'm not letting you hurt anyone. Well, not until Norma gets here and I skip bare ass free out the front gate. And that will happen. Michonne. Well, hey now. Don't you two look like your daddy? Back when he still had a face. 
<laughs> what? Yeah. Got a big hole there now. Michonne, is that true? Please tell me he's fucking with us. Randall murdered your dad, Sam. No! Jones just been fumbling around like a bear cub fucking a football. Randall has more value if he's alive. Gives us something to bargain with when Norma gets Listen here. Listen to me. That won't work. They only bargain with bullets. All she wants is her brother back. That's it. We're out of the equation. You need to kill him, or I will. Sam, wait! No matter what I say, you're just gonna do whatever you want anyway. I know you've already made up your mind. Well, <laughs> I ain't had the bail of the bar. Well, maybe that's you. Because when this dance is over, you're fucked. Kill me, and Norma hunts you down until you're all dead. Fucked! Let me live, and I do even worse. Fucked. But we both know how this is gonna end, Michonne. You like killing. And you'd like killing me, wouldn't you? Just tell old Randall the truth. I got thick skin. You won't hurt my feelings. You're wrong, Randall. Am I? Or maybe. Maybe you think you can rise above all that. But there ain't no heaven up there, honey. And there ain't no hell down below. There's only this shit every day until you die. And you know what's the fucking kicker? You get up and keep walking. There's still a chance we can make things better. Don't tell me you still believe that lie, Michonne. This is the world your kids are dying in, Michonne. <gasps> or dying in, or are in that walking purgatory. Shut up. Don't talk about that. Either way, they're suffering. And mommy isn't there. We all have our demons, honey. Some are on the inside. Some are sitting right in front of us, wondering what kind of a mother brings a child into this mess of the world. I spent a lot of time in low, low places. Where you only have your thoughts for company. And those can be mean, nasty. You want to believe all lives and all deaths have a purpose. Believe me, they don't. It's true. Things always fall apart. But we're the ones who bring them. Back.